Born in at the state capitol ready to hit the ground running as their work gets underway very soon. Again, it comes after Governor uh, Jeff Landry's inauguration ceremony yesterday. The BDSU's Cassie Sherm is in Baton Rouge and Cassie, what is the energy like there today? Well, Stella, we're hearing a lot of fresh, we're seeing a lot of fresh and familiar faces, and we're hearing a lot of new ideas coming from the Senate here. Now, I've had a lot of optimism coming from the people I've just been speaking with here. Whether they're veterans or newbies, they tell me they're excited for the 2024 season. Now, in the House of Representatives, we have over 30 new names coming into the mix and several in the Senate. Now, legislator already gets to work next week to take up redistricting and then a special session on crime in February. Other key priorities lawmakers are hoping to tackle this year are insurance rate, tax breaks, and infrastructure, just to name a few. I caught up with U.S. Senator Bill Cassidy, who says this year Louisiana will see positive results. Is there anything that you're looking forward to for this 2024 year? I think Louisiana is just going to start to rise like a phoenix, uh, and, and this is part of that. Uh, there's billions of dollars being invested in our state, creating new jobs, improving our tax base, which then brings resources to make other things better. The infrastructure bill, which, uh, which on the federal level we passed, but the state legislature passed uh, handled very well, is going to be not only creating jobs, but addressing infrastructure needs. You put that all together, and our state's on the rise. Now, both local Democrats and Republicans tell me they're hoping to work together under this new leadership. They may have different ways of solving some of the issues, but they all agree these issues need to be fixed here in our area. Reporting at the Capitol, I'm Cassie Sherm, 